pupils were evacuated from a secondary school after it burst into flames this afternoon. Witnesses claimed to have heard a huge explosion before fire crews were called to Northfield Academy, with plumes of smoke pouring from the building. Dramatic pictures from the scene showed thick black smoke filling the sky over the Granite City. Orange flames appeared to be leaping out of parts of the building, reports the Daily Record. Scottish fire and rescue crews were called to the incident at 1.43 p.m., with the fire under control by 2.15 p.m. The school is understood to have a capacity of around 800. Aberdeen Council said the children have been sent home, but it is unclear if anyone has been injured. In a tweet, the local authority said, due to a fire at Northfield Academy, the school has been evacuated. Arrangements are being made for pupils to go home. Scottish Greens politician Guy Ingerson, who lives a few streets away, reported hearing an explosion. He tweeted, just heard an explosion near or at Northfield Academy. Really worried about the people there. He added that he had seen workers on the roof but have no idea if any of them or school staff were injured. Mr. Ingerson then told the Evening Express, we went outside and just saw a massive column of smoke. When we heard the bang we could feel it too, it almost felt like the house shook a little. It's quite dramatic. Several other locals also reported hearing an explosion and a loud noise on Twitter. One social media user thought the fire was coming from NHS Grampian Hospital, which is located a short distance from the school. Unconfirmed reports claim the fire was caused by a generator being used at the school. Building work is taking place at the school, with scaffolding visible around the site, according to the Express. A spokesman for the Scottish Fire and Rescue Service said, We got a call at 1.43 p.m. about Northfield Academy in Aberdeen. We have four pumps and one height vehicle in attendance. We have two jets in use. Police Scotland were also called to the scene to assist firefighters, a force spokesperson said.